This is a New Year's exercise for you for 2022. This is something that will be your own personal experiment just to see what would happen if people really turned around and paid attention to the world. It's a suggestion for building the power of loving kindness in this world with family each night. I mean, why not? There's billions of us on the earth. If word really got around that united, we could really make a difference for the earth and for ourselves and our families, why not give it a try? Remember the Buddha, he said, what you think and ponder on becomes the inclination of your mind. Listen, it's been said across time that regardless of what faith you mention, all through history, families throughout the world have wished for peace and kindness in this world. This is a universal wish. When I was young, I often wondered what would happen if everyone on the planet actually wished at the same time for all beings to feel happy. Could loving kindness grow big enough inside of all of them? Could they grow compassion, be at peace with all living things? I always believed there was a power someone forgot to tell us about while we were growing up. Someone must have forgotten to tell us about our species, everything. And, and then I read something recently while I was doing some research. I read about what Greg Kramer did with his children while they were growing up in Oregon in the United States. And this is truly one way we can experiment to see for ourselves if loving kindness can grow stronger in our world. If you will try this for one month together, you might begin to understand what I'm saying. You should also offer to include the entire family with you when you do this experiment. It doesn't take long. It's only a few minutes before you go to bed at night. You will be putting the entire world into this wish in your mind each night. It also felt good each night before bed to think of all we loved in this world. Maybe together some good things can happen if we do this together each night to help the health of and all the hardship that people have felt in the past two years. Before sleep, this wish brings a good feeling into each of your hearts. Are you ready? Okay, let's do it. Here is how you get started. The instruction. You are to ask your children at bedtime to close their eyes and relax in the bed. You may include any elders who wish to join in the experiment too, because it is suggested that everyone first pay attention to their eyes and relax as they listen. It's easy to do. Also, they should pay attention to their bodies and just notice the sensation of lying down or sitting close by and listening to your words. Just relax. Pay attention to your eyes. Now you ask them to think along with you while you are saying the following. Ready? You know, it's important to send loving kindness to yourself each day. You really need to learn to love yourself and to want yourself to be happy. I will say this wonderful prayer or wish, and you should listen to me now and repeat it together with me as we both learn it, okay? 
Now, listen closely. First thing you say, I love myself. May I be free from anger. May I be free from sadness. May I be free from pain. I really want to be free from pain. May I be free from difficulties. May I be free from all suffering. May I, my body be healthy and strong. May I be filled with loving kindness. May I know the joy of generosity and love. May I be happy. May I really be happy. May I be at peace. I spread this loving kindness out. I send love to dad and mom. May mom and dad be free from difficulties. May they be free from pain and sadness. May they be free from attachment and free from anger and ill will. May they be free from all suffering. May mom and dad be healthy and happy. Completely healthy and happy. May they be at peace. I send loving kindness to both my brothers or sisters. May they be free from sadness and anger. May they be free from sickness. May they be free from all suffering. May they be happy and free. Free from suffering, free from difficulties. May they be well and happy. May they be at peace. I love loving kindness for all my teachers. And the kids at school. Even the ones I don't know. May they all be free from sorrow and suffering. May they be free from anger and difficulties. May they be happy and free from all difficulties and sadness. May they be well and happy. May they be at peace. I send love now to all the people. Even the ones I don't know everywhere on earth.
May all beings on the planet be free from suffering. May they be free from pain and grief and despair. May they be free from happiness with happiness. Truly happy. May they be at peace. May all beings in the universe be free from suffering. May all beings in all universes, everywhere, be free from suffering. May they be well and happy. May they be at peace. May all beings of all kinds in all directions be happy and at peace. Above and below, near and far, high and low, all types of beings, humans and non-humans, seen and unseen, all the animals, birds and fishes, all beings and creatures, with no exceptions, may they all be happy. May they be free from harm. I open my heart and accept the loving kindness from every being and creature in return. I let that love into my heart and I share the benefits of this meditation. with everyone. May all beings be well and happy. May all beings be well and happy. May all beings be well and happy. May there be peace. May there be peace. May there be peace. Now, Mom and Dad and Gram and Grandpa, now following the meditation, each child gets a kiss and an I love you. Greg would lie there briefly and then he would leave his kids. Now, the thing you need to remember about Greg is that he taught his boys this prayer until they were 16 or 17 years old, and they knew it by heart, and they would choose to do it every time instead of playing a game or reading a book or anything else. They wanted to do this together with their dad. Greg did that all those years, and then... His boys got married. And guess what? Greg Kramer's boys, they are doing it with their kids too. And that's really something. And I think it's special. So that's why I shared this with you. And I wish you all a very happy new year. Sadhu, sadhu, sadhu.